Welcome everyone to BCC Art Studio. I'm Billy. And today I would like to share with you a technique I like to call shape dipping. So the first thing to start is laying down something you can pour your paints onto, like freezer paper or wax paper. This will enable you to remove the paint skin after it dries. I chose to do the open cup pour for this technique. If you're new here and enjoying the content, why not consider hitting that subscribe button? By subscribing, you'll stay updated on all the latest videos and join our community of art enthusiasts. It's a great way to show your support and never miss out on any of the creative adventures we embark on together. So go ahead, hit subscribe, and let's dive into the world of art together.
are the markers I used. I mean, it's uh, like an acrylic glitter marker type thing. The only thing is, they're by Pebio, I think that's how you say it. But if you look, the language is in a different language. Um, even the description and everything is in a different language. But they work really well. In a minute, I will show you the dried results. And then I will show you a resin result. Um, but yeah, if I roll one of these over, even the description is in a different language. So I'll show you the dried results and then I will show you the resin results. So here is the butterfly and that is the dried Pebio marker with the blue glitter and black. And here is the heart. Yeah, I guess they're kind of like glitter pens and I bought these a while ago so I do not remember but I do know that I got them off of Timu. So if you're interested in the Pebio glitter markers, they, you can find them on Timu. Here is the star. And here is the flower. Now I wish there would have been more color in that flower, but it's my first time doing anything like this, so we'll see what the resin can bring out. I'll be back with the dried results of the resin.